Uh, gang, let's do a comic book haul. Let's do a comic book haul. I imagine the pomegranate wouldn't allow the vodka to get the... Oh, no, no. It's amazing. It's amazing. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Gang, let's open this up. Let me tell you how much this, this baby ended up costing. Let me tell you how much this baby ended up costing. This thing was expensive. Okay. Total was $508. Okay. The item cost $450 approximately. Shipping was $33. And taxes came out to $30. Okay. Total $508. Uh, that's how much this baby cost. Okay. $508 let me crack it open let me crack it open do you guys want to guess what it is do you guys want to guess what it is what are some of your guesses you've seen this before you've seen this before Padre, Padre, Padre. The caddy mode is iconic, man. I always wonder what was up with that yeah it's awesome love the caddy mode what's in the box what's in the box uh, Prof John Doe uh, has the upper hand I finished the DC comic you sent me. Awesome. Granted, there was only two of them, but ah, that's good. I'm glad you 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 read some of them. Awesome, man. Awesome. I can't remember what I what I ended up sending you, but I think they were good. I think they were good. Bojo Master, yo, how are you doing, Ghostface? It's a smaller box. <laughs> smaller box. Froggy says, I guess a clock. Superior hands says magic mushrooms. No, magic mushrooms would be cheaper than $500. <laughs> it's it, prices dropped a lot. A ball, Eduardo says. Haha. -ha. Uh, you gave me a lot of. Yeah, yeah, I sent you a big package. Awesome, awesome. Okay, gang, check this out. Okay. Now, you would have seen this before. Okay. Cheval Noir, nice. Cheval Noir number one. No, it's too it's too small to fit the comic. It's not a comic. It's not a comic. Now, you would have seen what I'm about to pull out before. Okay. I bought one of these things from the seller. And I was bidding on a couple more that he put up. And I was outbid by other buyers. Right? I was outbid. Outbid the cat. <laughs> I was outbid by other buyers, right? And then the guy sent me sent me a message saying, "Hey, listen, uh, are you are you interested in more of the set that you bid on? I'll give you a deal on it, okay? And uh, I have three of them if you want it." And I said, uh, "How much? How much for shipping and stuff like this? I'll take it, okay? Okay. So there's three of these things in here." Felix, hey Chicho, how's it hanging? Hanging good. So annoyed, I missed the. Oh yeah, brother Felix, I have almost 15k, 50,000 points saved up. You're gonna do a nice haul next year. There's three of these things in here, and I ended up. He ended up uh, charging me 150 a pop US. Okay, 150 a pop US. <laughs> I had to do it. This is this is considered investment grade stuff. Like if I find something that I'm interested in investing in for long term, this is what I do. So what you're witnessing right now is a little bit of personal finance thrown in here, right? A little bit of personal finance thrown in here, right? Um, oh, this is gonna be loud for the mic. So I'm gonna try to do this gentle so it's not too loud, okay? Again. There's one. <laughs> Quick on the baby. <laughs> There's another one. Did you see it? <laughs> Rotten to the core with the Trump cards. My guess is three decks of cards. Which set of cards? Rotten to the core. Rotten to the core. nice nice gang let's put this here let's put this here and when i when i messaged him he said he had three three sets three additional sets and 
and I said I'll 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 take them for 150 a pop, right? 150 a pop. Uh, but I like to see the trump card, right? I like to see the trump card. And he said he's he sent me pictures of the trump card. Okay, what mic do you have, Chicho? Because I don't know uh, what it is, but your channel gives me the most insane smart tingles, and nobody else does. Awesome! It's a it's a what do you call it? The blue yet yeti thing that I've had for a while. I'll do ten thousand for it. Ah, Ronnie, awesome! So he 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 sent me pictures of the Trump card, and they looked beautiful they look mint and he sort of said it himself he said when i cracked it open it looks like the boxes haven't been opened uh the cards are they look amazing so we're gonna take a look okay we're gonna take a look the boxes seem to be wrapped up a little bit oh nice i have that too do you oh very nice very nice so the box is a little roughed up let's see how the how the cards are right nice the cars look good there's number one right there's number one so you traded 500 pieces of paper for 156 pieces of paper basically no 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 traded uh there's third no there's a, <laughs> there's actually only 36 cards in here 36 times three what is that 90 18 108 pieces of paper plus three boxes for 500 pieces of paper or five pieces for 156 let's check this out let's check this out oh yeah these look really good really good let's take a look at the trump card nice nice put the thing on here oh yeah this is beautiful this is beautiful check this out check this out nice copy nice copy like I'm really tempted to send these in to be graded right coffee but this paper is gonna go up in value remember that Rero the paper that I traded for is fiat currency so the value inflation kicks that price of that paper down but the price of this paper goes up so depending on the paper you're trading in right these look fantastic really and the Rudy Giuliani card is the last one. Here's the Giuliani card. And this looks great as well. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trump card, King Kong. <laughs> like literally a Trump card. Trump's rookie card, right? Now, I don't, I don't, you know, doesn't matter what you think about Donald Trump, right? Because your emotion should be let's crack the, the other ones open too i want to check out the trump card on them really let's check this stuff out uh because when it comes to investment right you should you should invest in if if you want to stay sane and stuff you should invest in things you believe in right uh, but i don't have to like trump to invest in a trump rookie card right because no matter what you think of Donald Trump, uh, you would have to agree he is probably, he is probably really the most important political figure that has come on the scene for as long as I've been, I've been alive or you have been alive for as long as even my father has been alive he is ridiculously important okay and this is his rookie card this to me is a collectible worth investing in okay uh, 
I like to call him DJ Trump. Haha. <laughs> Not a fan of Don, but TDS is so real. Both my parents became US citizens under the Trump administration. Ronnie says, wow. And I became a resident under his administration. Cool, cool, cool. Very cool. Being yeah, these look brand spanking new. Like these haven't been opened yet. Wow. Great deal. Great deal. Uh, and if you watched uh, the previous live streams, uh, previous hauls that we did, you'll know that I've paid uh, anywhere between a hundred to two hundred dollars a pop for these. And the one that I paid a hundred dollars for, the trump card wasn't in mint condition. Uh, so one hundred fifty dollars for mint cards. For Giuliani and Trump, because I've seen the Trump card being sold, one that graded at nine. What was it sold for? Like five hundred, six hundred dollars. So graded card, this graded card sold for anywhere between five to six hundred dollars. I saw one go for nine hundred in the last few months. Okay, there are some that are listed right now at five hundred dollars. Uh, but this is better than nine these cars are mint uh, mint plus so I'll make sure to keep this in nice and safe and we got three of them freedom baby freedom of course the Statue of Liberty given to the United States is a present by the Freemasons in France <laughs> sort of takes away <laughs> from it yeah these look phenomenal froggy what's on the other side it's a description so each card we're going to do a reading of all these cards by the way at some point we just got to finish off the jfk one so for example this one this is rotten to the core this is card number one right and on the back of it it says new york city hall rotten to the core right and it's got a little bit of history now we've done the reading for the drug uh here i'll make it so it uh come on so focus so you'll be able to read it let's see if it's gonna focus oh, oh there it is we did the reading for the drug war trading cards right uh, if you do a search for them and then we also did uh We've done a third of the reading for the uh, JFK assassination. So this one, New York City is a is a business. Each year, it awards. Let me read it like this. So, so New York City is a business. Each year, it awards four billion in contracts to thousands of firms for services such as sewer repair, towing, and collecting unpaid parking tickets. It it sells taxi cab medallions cable tv buses and catering franchises grants occasions um, concessions on city land for parking parking lots and retail shops leases more than eight eight eighty million dollars in private office space and controls real estate development through zoning regulation and tax laws the corruption and influence peddling involved in dispersing city funds and collecting city city fees are the subject of these cards right so 36 cards talking about some of the people institutions organizations that are influencing what's happening in the united states in new york city in the united states right huge donald trump these came out in 1989 donald trump was a huge part of that right uh political power in new york city rests with local uh democratic democratic uh, clubs club leaders are power brokers slicing up city contracts and patronage jobs like pieces of a pie by a pro uh, appointing department heads and controlling votes on the board of uh estimate club these are really small that's why i'm going really slow on this so uh 
Estimate Clubhouse members can make or break financial deals in exchange for campaign contrib contributions and, in some cases, outright bribes. They offer non-competitive bids, sweetheart contracts, tax breaks, and lowered fees. The city could provide its citizens with the nation's finest services, but the clubhouse system ensures that key decision-making jobs go to members who never face the test of the voting booth and whose only qualification may be a willingness to look the other way. It's been, it's been said that honest city government isn't possible. The only way to test that theory is to kick out the clubhouse poll, um, clubhouse poise, who, like many uh, mentioned here, are rotten to the core. Okay, and so rotten to the core trading cards, uh, text 1989, Mulroney and Gold Art, no uh, great, ba, 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 ba. but we'll have a read through all this. Okay, phenomenal. You'll learn more about politics in these 36 cards than you would in any civil class, any civil course you take or curriculum you take in school, right? Just the same way we learn more about the drug war trade and the war on drugs and the corruption involved in it and the CIA than uh, in the drug war trading cards than we would have ever learned reading anything from corporate uh, mainstream media or centralized indoctrination centers. Okay. Ch -ch -ch. Numbers the same for cars as comics being top dog. Um, the grading system for cars, I don't know them well. I don't have any graded cards, not yet anyway. And uh, I, I looked at it very, very just quickly. Okay. And there's a couple of different grading companies out there. Uh, but I'll tell you more about this uh, later, I guess. Uh, but from what I understand, there's I've seen grades of uh, 7, 7 8, 8 9, 9 5, 8, 8.5, 9.5, 9.5, and 10. Okay, gems. I don't, I haven't seen any 9.8s. Um, 10, there's lots of 10s that I've seen being sold. So, for example, the Trump card uh, graded at 10, I've seen it listed for a few thousand bucks, right these would be a 10 in my book okay reroll by any chance you show do you have any more crinkling bags i'm having a shortage of tingles and i need more <laughs> awesome. i'm so weird to think about how old some of this stuff is yeah yeah amazing that's what the human artifact artifacts right Human artifacts, right? Froggy, froggy laugh out. Whose only qualification is looking away? This is hilarious. Also, that wasn't informative. It was editorial. It was informative. A lot of people don't know that government. They 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 collect taxes, right? And they hand it out to their own people, right? That's it. A lot of people think this is. They, they don't understand. A lot of the stuff is no bid contracts. They hand out multi multi-million multi-billion dollar projects to their families and friends uh, or people who bought pay them out like a lot of people don't know this shit we need transparency of government man what the fuck right padre 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 these cars are from the same people who did drug war yeah yeah from the same people eclipse comics and uh, they put out a lot of cards man amazing amazing car one day i'm gonna have them all they put out cards on uh we looked at some of them a lot of political stuff like this they've also it's eclipse comics by the way eclipse comics and they put out uh the hell hellraiser cars deck one and two they put out cards on uh serial killers i have a couple of sets of those i bought way way back in the day right i don't have a complete set but i have a couple of packs and stuff so super cool <laughs> 